Yo, yo, yo. So, as you can see, I'm dead. As you can also see, I've been wrecked by Black Beetle and Fire Lizard. What makes it even worse is I just lost my hoverboard in the area where Fire Lizards are based. <sighs> so, I also have to say my armor is pretty much done. So I need to craft a new set of armor. I'll get this on the side for now. And in this episode, episode 16, we're gonna be going to get the damn freaking revenge for me getting wrecked and to those damn fire lizards that got my hoverboard. Also, as you can see, I discovered quite a big chunk of map. Um, I went around, so I discovered this bit, uh, finished this area, and then started going around here. But pretty much just in this area alone, I almost died multiple times. And I'm talking like a minimum of probably like five or six times almost died. Uh, only because there are so many hostile creatures around there, it's just unbelievable. And while I'm here, um, before we're gonna go, I really would like to get some jam going. Cooking table. That was cooking stove. Yes, apply matching recipe. Oh, yeah, I'm on this. Also, in the meantime, I think I found a new kind of food, the, the canned meat. And I'm also pretty sure we had like two different types of jam, didn't we? Uh, what are you doing? No, I don't want it. Let's go for the uh, berry jam. Does it actually make a difference what kind of jam you're having? I don't think so. Oh, I do have a sugar. I do have berries, so okay. This is going. In the meantime, I'm gonna drop all of this stuff here. And yeah, I am kinda gutted. Because especially those fire lizards. I literally lost everything. I lost all of my ammunition that I had. I lost the hoverboard. I lost armor. So I'm pretty much left butt naked. And I literally had nothing to defend myself with. That's why the black beetle finished me off. Because uh, I was already kind of half dead when I ventured into the area with uh, those damn fire lizards. So I'm just gonna get a few things going and I'm gonna craft I'm gonna craft the uh, new set of armor which is gonna be costly from what I remember. I think it's gonna be about 70 I think it was 70 steel. Yeah, I need rope. Which I can get by getting some fibers. Well, I don't need to because I got them. Four bits of rope. Okay, so... I don't want a work weapon workbench, I want an armor workbench. Let's go for it. And... A new weapon. I think it'll be a good time to get a new weapon. So, maybe this time I'm gonna go for machine pistol. Uh, we had the flintlock, we had the musket, revolver, luger is on half durability only because I've been just using it so much. So I'll just retire the luger as well. We got a lot of stuff that we will be repairing in the future, that's why I'm also creating a new, uh, new armor, a new helmet, because I know we can fix it later on. Um, so we got our armor back, I think mace, I will just drop it out because... I, I really hate using it. It's so slow and sluggish. I'll just leave it there so that it just uh, gets wiped off the server. So I'll craft the machete because I really, really like that tool. In the meantime, I'm just gonna go and check weapon workbench. I need rubber bits. 
which we should have five. Okay, so weapon workbench, and let's go for it. Machine pistol. And as far as I remember, machine pistol was yes. There we go. It was in the second. Um, it was in the second tier on the very bottom end of the uh, t of that tree. So what I'm gonna do is also I am going to create bolt action rifle and double barrel shotgun but that's gonna come in later so at this point I need what does it use is it 10 mil I think it's 10 mil ammo no 8 mil standard ammo okay so we almost got a full set uh, 8 mil standard ammo black powder so I need sulfur and potassium. Let's go for it. Let's craft as much as we can because I know this will be so ammo hungry. We're not gonna we're not gonna last with the uh, ammunition for too long. Okay, so let's craft even more. And while I'm here, I will also drop some of this stuff in the crate. I might need to create a new one because uh, this one is literally almost full, especially with all the uh, ingots from iron. Well, I will need some of the copper ingots. Let's get it like that. Okay, some ash, I'll drop it here, and charcoal. And in the meantime, we can drop bones and fat, sorted fur as well. I don't need. I'll put the pragmium away, this away, and this away. Leather can go here as well. And fur. Sorted out. Brilliant. And now pragmium. So we're good. And let's craft some ammunition. Weapon workbench, and as much as we can possibly get. Yeah, so maximum 660 bullets. I think this will be enough to get... Well, it's gonna be like 1200 bullets, to be honest. I don't really care about smelting. I really didn't want to actually... Yeah, that's worth mentioning. I didn't really want to get on and start recording because I didn't feel like it yet. I just wanted to get around 50% of map explored, but then I found this place. I don't even know what it is because one of the lizards just kept attacking me from the distance and I just couldn't get anywhere. So it's like, could you please give me some slack here? But uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna craft some, well, pharmaceutical chemicals. What do we need for it? Industrial chemicals. Oh my god, no, no, no. That's just a bit too much of a hassle for now. So I'm just gonna set down with, what does the bandage do? Healing, 10% bleeding, no, that's useless. Uh, okay, what does it give us? Nope. Um, okay, we can get mutations, that's interesting. Yeah, I'm just gonna go for this. I know we got a few in the fridge, but I want to have some extras on me. And then we're just gonna go with whatever we get. See? A few episodes back, we've set the um, gathering resources uh, on higher rates, and it's still kinda not as fast as it looked in the beginning. It still takes a lot of time to gather some of the resources, especially the ones that are quite rare, scarce. So, uh, there we go. Okay. So after we're gonna use all of this ammunition here, I'm gonna craft the uh, shotgun. I'll drop some of that stuff that I don't need. Where was the... Uh, glass here. Uh, powder? Black powder? 
here. Sugar still in God. All right. So bish bash bosh and fibers. All right. So I think we can almost move our ass to get get them lizards gone. I don't really know how hard they will be to defeat because I didn't have any ammunition or I didn't even get remotely close to them before I got basically obliterated and I really hate the black beetles because they are so fast it's almost impossible to outrun them so yeah I will have to be very careful next time I'm going around there I'll drop this and this here because I don't really need it sugar back again there is a lot of spoiled stuff. Well, not yet spoiled. Alright. I want some daylight. Yeah, I do want some daylight because I don't have batteries for my flashlight yet. Oh, there we go. That's literally what I needed. The rest room. Okay, craft some more. Three. I think I will go for about 20 of them. Because, obviously, those lizards, they just... They keep us on a distance, because I did not realize they are uh, spitting acid or something like this. So I couldn't even get close to them. World event. No, thank you. Well, I'd probably go for it. But, uh... Well, what do you think? Damn, there will be always something messing around with my plans. I will try to see what can we get from there. But ideally, I would like to go and pick up our um, hoverboard first. Because I am definitely not letting that go. All I need is just some rust shrooms. Please give us some rust shrooms. You know what? I'll just check in the fridge how many of the... Oh, there we go. Every time I just want to give up on something, the game just tells me otherwise that I am not doing it. Kind of like it. I kind of really like it. All I need right now is just a little bit more green herbs. That would be nice if I could find some. There is some more restrooms. Okay, that's it. I'm just gonna use whatever we got. Let's craft some more of the... Um, herbal remedy. I think we had some... Yeah, it's not much. It's really not much. Okay, so that's gonna be my mission on the side, to craft some more herbal remedies. But yeah, let's go, let's go. We don't have too far to the um, teleport, so I'm gonna go into the teleport itself. You know what, actually, considering most of the stuff that comes out from the event, we either already have it or we can craft it, I won't go for it. I will just go straight for the... Um, for the hoverboard because I really want to get that done during this episode and maybe just maybe if I'll have enough time um, start it on another episode in another episode but um, yeah we'll just see I really want to get my revenge right now not later right damn now Okay, so we're gonna lose a lot of health straight away because teleporters. Hmm, so we're gonna teleport here and then run down there. And we'll see. I've, I've noticed that there is like five or six lizards just in that one place, which means it might not be the easiest place to get around. 
I really want to see what is this red dot on the map. Oh, vodka. Yes. We gonna drink some vodka later on. If we um, if we succeed with the mission, yeah, why not? Okay. Let's see how this goes. Wait, is it the right one? Yes, it is the right one. Pay with my blood. <laughs> Straight away some mutated bollocks. And birds. And see what I mean? Literally, going through this area is just a death wish. It's literally deadly creatures left and right. Hey, I'll just carry on gathering all of the rust shrimps I can get and the um, green herbs. So next time when I go to base, I can just start crafting as much um, herbal remedy as possible. I think I will be using it as a single shot because there is a lot of uh, bullets missing. I mean, lots of bullets are missing the target, so... How the hell did you aggro on me from that distance? Okay, brace yourselves. The durability does not fall too fast as well. That's a good good sign. I've noticed there is a lot of pragmium around here. Okay, come on big boy. Not so tough when I got the um ranged weapon, isn't it? Okay, while I'm here. I'm gonna get the sulfur. It's gonna always come in handy. And let's take it slowly. Take it easy because I don't know what to expect. How many of those damn lizards are around? Right. How many of those damn lizards are right around here? That was a big brain fart. Hey, I'm, I'm really curious of what's this thing up there. Thankfully, he does not aggro on me from that distance. Oh, black beetle. Hey, go on. See what I mean? They just literally run straight to you. And you got small chances of outrunning them, like very slim chances. I'll pop another one. Sweet. So I'm on a medical cooldown as well. Oh, there we go. Oh, you want to tell me that I'm gonna burn? Hmm, interesting. So if I will go up there, I might just burn, which is quite interesting. Now I know that we can burn in this area, but it still does not explain what's in there. Oh, it's, a, it's supposed to be like a volcano or something. I'm not gonna mess with that beetle, because I'm really tired of them. Okay, so I feel like we will definitely recover our hoverboard. And it's not gonna be a huge cost. Yeah, it's very, very inaccurate. But it's quite pleasant to use, to be honest. It's like lugger, but uh, faster. And it has less damage. About half, literally about half the damage that lugger does. So I don't really know if it's like the best weapon to use, but... We are progressing, progressing quite quickly through the weaponry, and I think my very next one will be the shotgun. Pr 
probably I won't use it for as much as you would like me to, guys. Because we had the military shotgun and it wasn't the best. So I will probably just craft it for the sake of having it. Use it a few times and then just put it on retirement. This is the lizard that basically got me. One more. Okay. So we got this out of the way. And let's try to get our hoverboard. There will be another... I think there will be another lizard in here. I lured one out of there. Can I get there without being burned? You can just outrun them if you sprint. But it's just about... There is one and there is only one entrance to here. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I'm not getting there. That was quick. I would literally burn to crisp in a matter of seconds. But yeah, well, okay. We got our hoverboard. I'm going home. We got our revenge. They weren't actually that tough. It's just the matter of fact that I didn't have any ammunition on me. So. So yeah, they could literally make a quick work out of me. Did we have a uh, mutated ball? No, we didn't. So let's get him. Damn, he's tough. Okay, so we're gonna have a lot of meat. Now we can drop in our, I think, the malt box. Because we are slowly running out of biomass that could carry on creating fertilizers for us. But I think I will also have a lot of green herb to make some um, herbal remedies. And yeah, I would ideally like to start crafting med kits before next episode. Because... Um, yeah, 80% healing versus um, 30, I think, from the Herbal Remedy is a big difference. But the um, first aid kits are quite pricey when it comes down to the raw materials and whatever you need to use to craft them. So, I will just see. I will just see how viable that is at the current time. Some more lizards. Some boars. Okay, let's collect the points for them. We almost killed everything, so we, st we need to start getting. Uh, we need to start getting the uh, bigger creatures. So I know where these are. I don't know what this is, and I don't know what this is. So I think three of them will be based on the event itself. But. Again, we will shortly see. I should have taken the teleport, but teleporter, but uh, well, well. While I'm going through the land, I'm gonna gather every single possible. Well, this is gonna be a lot of fish bait. Every single possible material for uh, the uh, medicine stuff. Never too much, to be honest. Okay, what else can I drop? I could drop one fat. Okay. Yes, we still got about 487 bullets. But, um, yeah. To be honest, I like to use this weapon, but I dislike the weapon itself. Because it wastes a lot of ammunition that you could potentially use on something else. I would say that actually Luger was much better. Because Luger was, Luger was kind of semi-auto. While it was also uh, dealing a bit bigger damage than this. And it always shot on target. Which means you had much better efficiency for your uh, ammunition. But... 
Well, there is always a trade-off, I guess. So, let's get back to base and let's see what we can make. Actually, I like that you can shoot from the hoverboard. That's actually quite sick. You don't have to get your lazy ass off the hoverboard to fight your adversaries. I think I will use the teleporter from here. Also, as you can see, I'm already down to about 50% of the uh, energy with hoverboard. Because of this chunk of the map and those bits. So yeah, I did a lot of traveling. I'm just curious if it's gonna leave my hoverboard here or if it's gonna take it with me. Perfect, my blood. Yeah, it's gonna move it with me. Nice. That's always nice to have. Okay, so we are almost at our base. And I think the very next thing that I will look into right before I start creating some more uh, herbal remedies is gonna be um, the fuel cells. Because once this runs out, I don't have anything else. I think I have only one left. Which, uh, with the way I'm using them, it's not gonna last for too long. Because my next thing... Obviously I'm not gonna do it today because I already spent like 30 minutes or half or, or more than that. Um, but I really want to get another chunk of the map discovered. So I probably will end up discovering this bit and maybe this chunk. So I think that might be a mission for tomorrow. After this episode I will just go and get some stuff crafted. And, um, and yeah, just basically... Uh, make sure that uh, I got enough of resources for the future for the near future so let's craft maximum which is only six that's not ideal okay so I need the water jugs that I think we should have enough to craft more sweet so herbal remedies, where are they? Oh, they are not here because I obviously took all of them. So yeah, they only heal 30% health. Which is not the best. I'm gonna grab every single one of them. Then drop these ones here. Blue one, I'm not entirely sure what the blue one does, so I just will... I'll just move it here. MRE. I don't think we ever ate an MRE. So let's just get this out the way. Yeah, there we go. Food. We don't even have half of the food from the game consumed yet. So now I need green herbs again. I think it would be very nice to just have seeds for the green herbs and all the other types of herbs. So you could just literally have them growing in your garden. But I guess it wouldn't be uh, the best option for the PvP game where resources like this are quite valuable. But hey, let's craft some more. So I ended up with about 40 herbal remedies. That's not bad to be honest. Okay, so I'll just drop all of this stuff, maybe just craft some fish baits because I'll probably end up going to do some fishing yeah I want to get this skill on the maximum level so cooking table max that's 50 baits I will be fishing for half an hour at least and we also got 500 points back again so yeah let me just drop all of this stuff back here this and this also while I'm here I will just Drink this, first time, and vodka, first time, drunk, 70%, sweet, that's what I like. <laughs> okay, so drop this one here, this one here, did we ever have a, a the energy drink? Yes, we did. Okay, so, accept all of this. 
this is for later this is for later drop this and last two things that I can drop in here and that's it I would definitely like to get some more things done but those damn lizards basically made me backtrack and lose about yeah, good chunk of a progress that I could have made because I would co I could probably cover this part of the map by now. But anyways, enough talking for now. Thank you so much for staying here till the end, and I will see you in the next one. Danon out. <laughs>